Tottenham struck while the iron was hot on Tuesday as they appointed Antonio Conte as their new head coach little more than 24 hours after dismissing his predecessor Nuno Espirito Santo. Conte has signed an 18-month deal to keep him in North London until 2023. Conte is a big-name manager who has tasted success at a string of clubs and his arrival was welcomed by the Spurs faithful. During his only other spell in England the 52-year-old led Chelsea to the Premier League title in 2017 and FA Cup triumph the year after. After departing Stamford Bridge, Conti took on the top job at Inter Milan and steered the team to their first Serie A title in over a decade last season. He previously won another three Serie A titles with Juventus. Conti is expected to reverse Tottenham's recent struggles and get them back on track to compete for a place in the top four. The new head coach is expected to delve into the transfer market in January to bolster the team's ranks in their quest for Champions League football. But Spurs transfer chief Fabio Paratici will be under big pressure to ensure Conte doesn't repeat his transfer mistakes from his time with Chelsea and Inter. Conte was handed sizable transfer budgets at his previous two clubs, but many of the players he signed turned out to be huge flops. The former midfielder persuaded Chelsea Chiefs to shell out £60 million to land Alvaro Morata from Real Madrid in 2017 after missing out on Romelu Lukaku. But the striker failed to get up to speed in England and was shipped off to Atletico Madrid on loan just 18 months after signing for Chelsea, before joining to Spanish side on a permanent deal. That same summer, Conti landed Danny Drinkwater for Leicester City as Chelsea spent a staggering £35 million for for the midfielder. Drinkwater performed well in his season under Conti but was cast aside under Maurizio Sarri, and his career has been in free fall ever since. Perhaps Conte's worst signing for the Blues was time at Bakayoko, who moved to West London for £40 million after the player had impressed for Monaco. The midfielder showed what he was capable at times during his first season in England, but was exposed in a match against Watford as he cost his side a goal due to an error before he was sent off. Bakayoko is still a Chelsea player but hasn't played for the club since Conte departed with the 27-year-old's last appearance for the Blues coming in the 2018 FA Cup final. During his time at Inter, Conti also spent big money on a whole host of players to give him the squad he wanted. The San Siro club spent notable fees on the likes of Valentino Lazaro, Matteo Politano, and Yonut Radu, who all flopped at the club while other players Conti brought in for much cheaper also failed to impress. Conti has a habit of being overzealous in the transfer market and Tottenham Chiefs, and Paratici particularly, will need to work closely with their new boss to target players who can be a success at the club. Spurs have a reputation for being money smart, they won't want to change that now.